It's James Banks here for Up Close Gamers. I'm here with Dignitas Bling. He's been playing in the IPL UK qualifier for StarCraft 2 and he has done so well and like the best UK player that's come all this way and come leap and bound since joining Dignitas just under a year ago. How are you feeling? Very good. Very good. <laughs> <laughs> so he's given us a short answer. But um, explain how like your practice has been in preparation up until this event. Um, I've been playing as much as I can. Uh, I've had a few difficulties with my wrist. Uh, I started developing carpal tunnel. Um, it wasn't so serious, but still it got in the way. So I couldn't play for three weeks or so. Um, but, you know, I've kind of just got on with it. Um, I, f I, I think I came into the event pretty well practiced uh, and I caused a few upsets. So I'm quite happy with that. Um, yeah. So do you think because of these results, some people are going to start taking more notice of you now? Um, I think they will. Uh, personally, I don't see them. Well, I don't, I don't see it making that much of a difference. Obviously, they will recognise me a little bit more, but I don't know. I think I've, I've got to win a big event before people start taking me more seriously. Um, but obviously, I'd like people to take me more seriously because, you know, people expected me to finish tenth, twelfth. So yeah, like, yeah. <laughs> yeah, you've done better than yeah. better than people would say you would have done. So, um, next event for you, you're not going to be at um, DreamHack Winter, but you're going to be at WCG in Korea, and you plan to stay out there for a little bit longer. So, talk us through that a little bit. What's going to be happening for you? Um, I'm going out to WCG on the 5th of December, uh, and then hopefully I'll be staying out there for one or two months, hopefully two, um, depending on how it goes, depending on if I enjoy it or not. I'll be staying in a team house. Uh, I'm not sure which one yet, but everything should get confirmed kind of within the next few weeks. So I'm looking forward to that. Uh, it'll be good fun for sure. And I think, I think it'll help me a lot. It'll help me with my game for sure, because I think I've got so much to improve on. Um, rather than like the other players that have gone out there, say like Nani Wan Huck, they've always been at the top level and like they've just kind of got better, more solid and stuff. But I think like there's so much more for me to learn about the game and stuff and I think it'll just help me in so many ways so when I come back I'll just I think that's when people will start to notice hopefully anyway uh, yeah <laughs> so we were watching the finals together what did you think of them games was it a surprise or at one point did you think Tails was going to win it what was it like for you yeah uh, after Tails took the first game I, I was like wow he's going he's gonna to make a comeback um, but from the beginning I thought Stefano would win was, He's Zerg and he's Stefano, so <laughs> it's like against the odds, whatever the case. Um, but yeah, I was, I was quite impressed with how Tails played. Like, I didn't expect him to take two games like he did, but um, I thought Stefano was going to win in the end, and he did. So I guess there was no real upsets in the finals. <laughs> OK, so let's round this up a bit with quarter of you once already. And yeah, you, you're going to want to rest now. It's been a long, long weekend. So um, anything, any last words, anything you want to say to your fans? Uh, I love you, I love you mum, I love you Banks, <laughs> uh, yeah, shout out to Team Dignitas, everyone. Great, thank you Bling. Thank you.